Hey everybody, welcome back to another video, uh, and today we're going to be playing some more Hollow Knight. So, in the last video I said that I would, uh, start recording if I did come up here, and I was able to, like, do some sort of skip or whatever. Unfortunately, there seems to be a door blocking the way, so I can't get in here, uh, early. So, I'm just gonna drop down from here. If you want to know how I got up here, I kind of just used this thing to kill myself so I could get up here using a Shade Soul. Um, sort of a speedrun tactic I seem to use, but it didn't, unfortunately it didn't work in my opinion, or, um, in my case, since there is a door there. So, we're just gonna go ahead and, and explore the rest of this area. Normally, no skips or anything like that. So, in the last video, uh, we defeated the Soul Master, I believe was his name. And we got a desolate dive, which is pretty useful. It kind of just lets us, like, destroy... It lets us destroy cracked grounds beneath us. And it also lets, just, lets us just, like, slam down on some enemies. Overall, pretty useful. It does get more useful, though. But, um, from what I remember, I think we should take this elevator since... I think it is actually important. It, I don't think it just takes us back to... Maybe it does, though. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it doesn't take us to some of Right? I believe so. Is this the... Okay, yeah. Uh, from what I understand, this does take us to somewhere... No, it does not. It does take us back to the Forgotten Crossroads. I must have been thinking of another one. It's around here somewhere, I know it. I hear a vessel fragment. Nice. Now let's go to the right of us. Pretty sure... Yeah. Although there is a place that we can go here now, now that we have the, um, the dash, but also the Manus Claw. Actually, there's a completely different place we can go. Yeah, I remember. Alright, so now I know where we're going. I'm kind of having, like, a... Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. There's a couple places we could go. Hold on. My mind is racing now that I remember all these things. So. Hello there. Ooh, you surprised me. Hello, hello. Come in, sweetly, sweeting. Come in and make yourself at home. I'm Salubra. And this is my cozy little charm store. Did the townsfolk out there tell you to come in and visit me? <laughs> yes. This is a lovely little village, isn't it? Warm and intimate and full of love. No, it's not. Hmm. What are you talking about? Oh yes, charms. I can see you've studied your own collection. Very nice. I'll show you some of my own. And you can take one home if you'd like. <laughs> so we got long nail. Uh, we don't want to buy this charm not immediately. Yes. Why not? Steady body. Eh. Nothing too interesting. Nothing too interesting. We couldn't get two of these charms even though they're charm not. So I think so we'll do all. Buy the cheapest ones. Since none of these charms are like super good. Long nail is actually pretty decent. But we're looking for the charm. Alright. So let's see, now that I got those two, that means I could equip the longer nail, but I'll go ahead and equip Soul Catcher, since it's probably gonna be more useful. Anyway, um, now, alright, there's a little tactic I want to show you guys. Hopefully it'll work. I think it'll work. So, I want to see if this, if my shade will be over here. 
<laughs> no, it won't. Is it felony over here? Alright, try again. No, close. Alright. So yeah, we can do this. Dang. Okay. So we're gonna try this a couple times, since this will kind of get us to, um, I'm not really skipping much, because I'm pretty sure you could still just, no, you can't do this without that, but I'll show you guys a little tactic that you can do, come on. This guy over here, and then if we do it correctly, we should be able to. We're not losing anything. All right. So two hits, and then the shade is down. Hold on. Dang. All right, we're close. We're close. Just to get him over here. I'm gonna attack us one more time. But we have to make him attack us like around here. There we go. Uh Okay, we'll we'll retrieve our shade once we've gotten a couple things from here. This shouldn't be like an area I die at or anything. So Shay doesn't just disappear. If you're wondering what that heartbeat is, it's a um, egg bubble thing around here. I don't know how to describe it or really what it is even. But now we can unlock a shortcut. Right there. Is that Night Dude around here? Yes, he is. We are not going to fight him. For we are far too weak, and he is quite strong. Okay, but we have to go over here. I'll fight this guy, though, since I kind of need Geo. Look, buddy, I don't want to fight you. Like one slip up and you take almost half my health. Which isn't a lot, but it takes a lot of your health. Here we are. So, go over here. This is where the stagway is. The only problem is, is that I'm kind of broke. Oh no, it's not a stagway. It's a train station. And the pass that you get is... So Wait a minute. Oh, no, I'm lucky because the stagway over here, or around here, doesn't actually require any geo, which is why this skip is possible in the first place. Okay, inspect. To protect the vessel, the dreamers lay sleeping. Monomon, the teacher, in her archives surrounded by fog and mist. Lurian, the watcher, in his spire looking over the city and Hera the Beast in her den amidst the deepest, darkest beyond the kingdom. Though through their devotion, Holiness lasts eternal. Dreamer locations out of the map. <laughs> Go no further, little shadow. What compels its out of the darkness? What compels its return to the sacred kingdom? A call from beyond the seals, by the vessel, or by the captive light? Would the, br would the seals break? They cannot be undone. But the vessel weakens. That plague springs anew. They must be undone. Yet still our seals remain. Our duty holds. It must be cast away. Our duty holds. It shall be done. Fade away, little shadow. Fade away and let us sleep in peace. Uh, nah, I don't think I could do that. Little 
platforming. Well, I mean, there has been a lot of platforming, but you no know, difficult platforming. Make sure you don't fall. Uh, <laughs> we're uh, we're not gonna talk about that. It just uh, you know, I took a nap for a second. That's all that happened. Oh wait, I think I still was put forward. <sighs> Alright, if I did the same thing again. Let's just take it step by step. What a terrible fate they visited upon you. They cast you away into this space between body and soul. Will you accept their judgment if it is slowly away? Or will you take the weapon before you and cut your way out of this sad, forgotten dream? Uh, the latter, for sure. We have acquired the dream now. Cut the veil between dreams and waking. Here. Ah, you've returned. Welcome back to the waking world. Those figures, those dreamers, they reached out with what little power they still have and dragged you into that hidden place. But that talisman you now wield, the dream nail, it can cut through the veil that separates the waking world from our dreams. Even the dreamers themselves cannot hide from such a weapon. Though I must admit, the sacred blade has dulled over time. Together, perhaps we can restore its power. We only have to bring the essence essence, the precious fragments of life, of light that dreams are made of. Collect it wherever you find it and bring it to me. Once we have enough, we can work wonders together. Go out into the world, weirder. Hunt down the essence that lingers there. Collect a hundred essence and return to me. I will teach you more. Alright. Uh -huh. Is there something up here? My, no, I don't think there is. I, I, think, I feel like I keep thinking there's something up there, but there never is. Alright, this is where the stagway is. And you... I believe it's just a bell. No, it's a yeah, it's a switch. Awesome. So now, I need to go back to dirt now because we have forgotten our shade and that has a lot of geo on it. No, I'm just gonna leave that stuff there. So. <clears throat> Mosey on over here. This should be this guy here, but I'm not gonna talk to him just quite yet. Hi. Do we need a simple key for this? We do. Eh, 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 it's worth it. And we do. Hello there. Welcome, small intruder. I've been sound asleep in here for some time. Some time? Ah, yes, yes. Well, now you've gone and woken me up. It's no matter, I suppose. I might even be able to help you out. I'm Gigi. And if you found... And if you have found your way into my chamber, you must need my help. You see, sometimes we leave our regrets behind in the world, like black stains. If we don't deal with these regrets, hope starts to drain from us. Do you have... If you have regrets of yours, little one, let me peer into you for a moment. Yes, I can see the regrets you've left behind. A dark stain just below us. Lost amongst the kingdom twists kingdom's twisted roads and highways. As a service, I can return your regrets to you, so they can be dealt with. You want that, yes? Ah, but I'm very hungry. Perhaps you'd be willing to part with a little food, sleep for as long as I have, and you build quite up quite the appetite. Yeah. Oh, ah, darling. Hmm. I enjoy this morsel tremendously. Now, as promised, we will begin the ritual. <laughs> Sorry, I destroyed. Oh, I destroyed some of your candles. Really? Oh boy, oh ah, you boy, seem to have made peace with your regrets in the most novel, and I dare say brutal, fashion. What a joy to behold. Farewell, Oracle, now. I th I will thank you as I savor my meal. Thank you. Okay, so, now that we've unlocked that little area, um... Pale thing. You wear that nail with ease. If you're in search of combat, you'll find no great warriors in this decaying burrow. 
I've heard of an arena that exists somewhere below, one built for our like. Meet me there and I will we will test your what skills you possess. I'll be heading down soon. Come and find me if you dare. Sure, buddy. Sure. You sound like another friend that I know. Alright. We don't need anything from here just quite yet. So, I got a resting grounds, but I think we just go back to the city storerooms, right? No, we go to the Forgotten Crossroads, because there is an area that we can't explore now. And I should have enough... Yeah, I haven't recorded for very long, so we'll go ahead and complete that. Oh, and you're right here as well. Huh, pale thing. Use these old lines. Pathetic. A real warrior carries himself to combat. He has no need for such convenience. Dude. Like, n did I ask? Did I ask if you cared? I mean, I'm just over here chilling, bro. Calm down. Okay, so it's above us, I believe. Look, buddy, look. I'm not here for all that. It wouldn't be over here, would it? I don't believe it would be. Let me check. Yeah, no, I don't think so. I think it's above me. Clearly, I haven't been here. Isn't this the dark path that you could take? It is. I'm like, technically, you could come here, but the problem is, is that you can't see anything. Yeah, we haven't. Been here. That's good. Little Geo, along with some of these dudes. There's that other charm we can collect where it like helps us get Geo. Oh, he didn't die. And I ran right into that. Or I guess jumped right into it. Maybe the correct terminology. Mark of Pride is such a good freaking link. Be free, little wormy, be free. I'm gonna eventually click my bounty on those. Although I like to collect it when it's like I have like a ton of them there. Okay, so. I mean, yeah, we could just go. Plus, there is up here that we could do. Has some geo, and it has a little green in the spot. I guess we could collect the dream nail essence for now. Although, this isn't where we're gonna get most of our dream nail essence. Alright, there we go. So, that's a fully awoken, um, dream tree now. Which we'll, uh, we'll probably go check all those out in, like, a separate video where we just, like, check out some cool spots in this game, like the dream trees and stuff like that. Because once you go, once you complete them and then you go back, you can, um, strike them with your dream now to see some interesting dialogue, if you guys want to see that at all. This 
is a grub, actually. There we go. That's all I got to say. Is she already? Oh, damn. I didn't even... Alright, so, uh, I missed kind of her beginning story. She doesn't really have, like, any major story. But, after you get the desolate dot... Why did I do that? I didn't even... Oh, well, okay, good, it comes back then. After you get the desolate dive, it sort of makes her possessed in a way where she just wants to kill you. There's like backstory and lore behind it. I'm not going to say much about it though right now. But yeah, that's basically what's happening. She, she's getting taken over by some light or essence that, you know, makes her want to kill you. There's no way of stopping it, so even if I did get there earlier, it's impossible. Dang, can you die already? Big boy. Alright. She kind of turns into one of those guys that are just like completely consumed by this lust to end you. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can find that one. Oh, okay, see you guys. Personal beef with these guys. One of the most annoying enemies. first. Which I know who sells that, but kind of sells it from on the web. Like he does everything he owns. So if you didn't know, we're in the Crystal Caverns now. Can't cheese it. Alright. Alright, this part. So, these things are killable. These guys are also pretty annoying. secret area you might discover. <clears throat> yeah, but you can't get across it, of course. We need something that's found later on in this area. That's how you go, by the way, just in case you want to know. little secret tactic nobody tells you about. Take a no kuchin. Let's go to the mountains. I've heard tales of a summit way up. There. Too far for me, though, and I'm not really one for heights. Right, you big baby. Yeah. I feel like that's just really easy to get without the end-to-ended -end thing it wants you to get. Because that's, that's like 800 Geo right there, like King's Idol. And you're supposed to have something else for that, but it's extremely easy to just get up there. Because... Me to dash that far. 
No. All right, let's get back up there. Okay, so here, Mr. Fatty is taking up the entire bench. After we sit on this bench, I'll end the video and then I'll do the rest of this area. we can get up here somehow no so that's going to end off for this video um i feel like these videos like the past two videos this video and this video are going to be a little shorter but um in the next video we'll claim the item that rests in this place and yeah once we get that that kind of kicks off with the game not entirely but it's sort of after that the game starts to get really hard well, not really hard but it, it just starts to kick off you know like story wise and gameplay wise. So, I guess I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I will peace out.